Hello guys, I'm Urban Fox Gamer, and today I'll be showing you a tutorial in 3ds Max on how to make a low poly card for your game, uh, for a stylized low poly game, or for your LODs, you know, or you can use it for your aesthetic projects or whatever it is you want to use a card for. So let's begin. Create, um, create tab box standard primitives box. We are going to Alt W for that to happen the full screen so we are going to make a box like so now we're going to make this poly here we are going to grab these edges these four edges make sure you're selecting the right edges we are going to connect edges make two then pinch it like so now let's grab this extrude here it's up to you if you want like the big window depends on your own style or shape language if you want to have the big window or a big body it's up to you because this is a stylized car cartoony car so it's up to you so I'm just going to do that the boot a little bit higher smaller Pull this in, pull this in, pull this in, whoops, like so. Make, make this a little bit curvy. There you go, just a little bit. Now I'm going to add more polygons. Um, right click, right click to reset. Now it's correct. We're gonna grab the bottom like so. Oops. There you go. Same goes with the top here. We like a little bit of that to be curved. Want this to be curved as well. Hmm. Stop here. So yeah, like that. So we have our general shape of our sedan or a coupe. Now we are going to unwrap it a little bit, so it it will save you a lot of time. So a little bit of UV mapping will help you a lot in the long run because this is going to be duplicated for uh, three times again. I know it's going to be altered a lot, but it's a general start to save you a lot of time and work in your workflow. So moving on, we are going to make the wheels the, and the mirrors. So we start with the wheels. I'm going to move this, make it um, five. Odd number sided um, cylinders are more circular for me than the even ones. Uh, well, that's my opinion. So I'm just going to convert this to poly again. Modifier, unwrap UVW. Open UV editor. Polygon, polygon here. Let's move it here. Grab this, 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 right click, break, because we are going to make this UV um, patterned. Usually tire threads are patterned. You don't have to make like a texture, a very long one. Because, because it's just, um, it just takes too much texture. Um, real estate, UV real estate. You can put like a higher resolution seamless texture with with just a tiling face. So make sure of of course I click this grid snap so the verts snap to each other. And let's just fix it. You'll be a little bit make it square. There you go. Um like that. So I want this bottom part, this other cylinder 
smaller because I don't want the other side to be mirroring the rim. It just looks ugly for me. Well, that's just me. Now, convert to poly again. Um, angle snap, 90, 90. Now, let's just place it here. Again, shape language, I want to like, um, contrast, to add like contrast to your model, well, stylized model is, to, it, uh, there's one thing needs to be big, it's up to you, it's like the window's gonna be big, the rest will be smaller, smaller, incrementally smaller. So yeah, I want the wheels to be smaller. Windows are big, next bigger part is the body. I need to make it smaller again and next is the wheels will be way more smaller of course car guy talk um, negative camber if you want to add positive camber if you're crazy or yeah overwatch style of wheels uh, there you go Make it like that. Oops. I'm going to shift duplicate. Not benefiting the UV mapping job that I did. Now I'm going to duplicate again by using a rotation, shift rotation. I'm going to use the wheel cylinder as my. There you go. Muffler, muffler tip. Of course, this is this face will not be seen. Just say polygons. Just going to delete this. Then move this here, and of course, I'm going to attach it to the model. There you go. Now for the mirror, I want this mirror to be like that like so convert it to poly that's what I did like that copy like so of course mirrors are angled towards the driver and this I'm gonna use this vert to be the bird to be attaching to the car so I'm going to pull that like that now I'm going to turn this um, before again before duplicating UV map I'm just gonna peel that quick and easy it's full of edges planar projection to remove all the edges boom there you go it's clean peel mode there you go if you don't use any projection, it will use um, those edges, the automatic edges, and you will not get this result. So bear that in mind. Like so. Convert it to poly. And place it here, make it smaller. Like so. Now to duplicate this to the other side, I'm just going to grab the car, I'm going to attach this, 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 and this. Now I'm going to detach this, um, the wheels, and the mirror. If you want to, if you want to go like to twin pipe, I'm going to detach this again. But this is like a single pipe. Don't want to twin pipe a, a commuter car. So what I did there is. The information of this car, the pivot point, is now taken, um, brought to the other model that I have detached. So whenever I mirror a copy to the Y axis, which is we are on the Y, boom, easy. Now we already have a base model for our other three cars, which is this is the, uh, the coupe, sports coupe. Uh, the hatchback 
the modern hatchback and the old school hatchback so you can we can just you know adding this here connect here or you can just move this a little bit like so oops and and use that like that grab the windows 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 make sure it's in polygon mode you can, as much as possible use absolute um, units meaning there's no like decimals as much as possible to, to so you can remember those numbers because probably you are following a design language a, 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 a shape language what I meant which is this the thickness of the windows is supposed to be this thick one centimeter something like that so hit OK. Now extrude. Now it's gonna be by normals. Yeah. Well, in this instance, I need to adjust it to five. Please give me five. There you go. Tada! If you go to the clay mode, it looks nicer to look at. You can end the tutorial here if you want, but if so, uh, if you want to see like how hatchback and the other stuff, please stay tuned. Thank you for watching. This is Urban Fox Gamer signing out.